just wanted to stick a quick apology in here because I did kind of promise that I'd post this video yesterday, if not the day before. But I've had quite a lot of major technical problems, especially with rendering and it taking about six hours longer than I would expect. But all sorted now, this video's up. Hopefully it'll be more on time next time. Hello people, and welcome back to my Minecraft Creeper Mining. I did send out a video yesterday promising to come back onto this because, you know, stuff happens. I'm a busy man. Well, I say I'm a busy man, I did kind of waste my day today sorting out things for this recording. But that doesn't matter, you don't need to pay attention to that. There's some more cool stuff happening, like up here, where my mouse is disappearing to. You will notice that the music... Why does it always do that? It's incredibly loud. Um, as I was saying, up here you'll notice I have a little banner. It's because I've been trying out some new stuff. Trying out a way to get the frame rate higher, so hopefully I l have less... My words got jumbled there. Hopefully I have less chance of messing up and being blown up. But from the position that I remember us being in at the end of the other episode, previous episode, we might not be very long for this world. That thing just popped up, didn't it? That's annoying. But since we're here, let's go. Let's see what we can do. So if I remember rightly, we should be in a cave. And we are. It's quite dark in here. I have more hearts than I remember having had. There's some iron ore up there. Is it currently night time or what? Well, I just heard a zombie. Another thing that like, I notice when looking back on my old videos, especially, I say old, they're not that old, on my videos, especially the one that I put up yesterday, is that I tend to use quite quiet and whispery voice. How did I get down here? So, what I'm going to try to attempt to want to do is speak in a louder voice and then like maybe edit the levels to whatever they want because thinking about it this way if it's louder you can make it quieter it won't decrease the quality it'll increase the quality if I speak quiet and then try and edit it louder it'll also increase the volume of all of the background noise and stuff making it sound rubbish Honestly, I'm so confused right now. How the heck did I get up here? Like that river's just like a water source block there. Maybe I fell from up there? Is that a possibility? Can I get back up? That looks like the kind of place I came from. Please don't tell me I have another episode where I starve to death. That would not be good. I honestly don't think I can get up there. Might have to hope for a zombie to come along and save my ass by giving me some rotten flesh. Oh goodness, this is the situation we're in. I'm going to uh, let this part of the video fast forward onwards because I think I can do that now. You know, when I suggest an idea to myself like this, like this creeper mining, in my head, I'm thinking, 
oh boy, this is going to be so exciting, it's going to be so cool and whatever. I'll be running around, blowing up creepers. I never imagined I'd be sick, sat in a cave for half an hour. I say half an hour, two minutes so far, but it will carry on. I'm sure, actually, I heard something on one video or another about having to be a certain distance away from mobs for them to spawn. I really should know Minecraft better, but I don't. I honestly think there's no way up there. Which leads me to think, why the heck did I put myself in this fateful position? These sandstone blocks keep tricking me into thinking that there's a way out here. There is obviously not. More fast forwarding. Oh, no, not more fast forwarding. I forgot I have wool. I'm allowed to place blocks on this. <laughs> oh, such a waste of like five minutes. Oh no, I can't get out. Yes, that's the stuff. Oh, that's a very loud like, gong noise. Raise your gongos. Right. If I put that there, then I should be. Ooh, and there's some cows. Would you look at that? Cows are my new best friend because they allow me to get food that's guaranteed not poisonous leather, which once I get some trees can be helped to improve my survivability as I've said in every single one of the last few videos so cows, cows are a man's best friend I cannot be held responsible for any breakage of grass because it's so darn easy to accidentally do that. Oh. Here we go, some raw beef. Oh, for a second now I was unable to eat it, not quite sure why. This should have my health regenerating. Got you trapped in a nice position. Yes, this is. This was like. You know when you're playing a. I don't know, The Binding of Isaac. Probably, like, the one viewer that I've got doesn't actually play The Binding of Isaac. But you know where you're playing a game where you're doing really bad and it's like once you die you don't come back and. Right, so it turns out this video software isn't all it lives up to be. It can only record 10 minutes per go. Which means I'm going to have to plan for this in my episodes, but it's only a minor inconvenience. And it means it's kind of easier to keep track on how long the episodes are. Each one's planned to be about 15 minutes, since I've done some fast forwarding in this episode. I'm going to want to keep it probably about 17, 18 minutes. Is that it's starting to get dark, or is that just... Well, I'll come back down here into my little cave. I need to ensure that I always have a safe way to get up. That hole doesn't look safe. 
Wait, but if I go in there, then I can just climb back up here. Let's... Ooh, that was the sound of a zombie. Where was it coming from? Are there any zombies about here? Better eat some raw beef before getting into any combat situations. It's very useful stuff. Um, nope, no zombies around here. <coughs> Ooh, that sounded nasty. My voice just went like total teenage voice break. Don't quite know why it did that, since I should be a lot older than you would be for that to happen. If that sentence made any sense. Where is this flippin' zombie? Ooh, I need to make sure that I can always get out of here. So... He said, as he threw himself into a position where he couldn't. I'm pretty sure there's probably zombies down there. But I'm gonna need my last block of wool. Um, of wool? Last block of wool. To get myself out of that situation. And then... Well, so far what's happened today is... I killed some cows. I think wise idea would be have I already had one day night cycle here? Well I think it's starting to get dark anyway. It'd be nice to find some creepers, blurps and trees. I think that cave is most likely gonna become my permanent residence. Ooh, bad damage. Go away seeds. getting dark, which is the scariest time of night. Dark, which is the scariest time of, time of night? Did I just say that? That makes so much sense. The good news is, I think I could make a full leather chest plate as soon as I get some wood for a crafting table. But, I'm gonna stop recording as soon as it gets to night and the point where mobs start spawning just in the general vicinity so that we can have some suspense, some build up to the next episode. Let's just check. This is. Is this the. Yeah, this is the cave that I'm gonna live in. So. Ooh. I need to get rid of these two lots of seeds because strictly speaking I shouldn't have them. And we are going to wait for some mob spawnage and then this will be the end of this episode and we can see what happens next afterwards. Yes, no, mobs are gonna spawn. Yeah. Are they? Haven't seen any yet. My render distance is ridiculously low. I can probably turn that up now because I've sorted this thing out with a different video recorder so that I have less. Oh, and there's a skeleton. That's not what we want to see. Was my cave again? My cave's there. I don't reckon I want to take on that skeleton. I might do just for the lols. Comment what you think, and this is me out. Save and quit to title.